Hello everyone, welcome back to Shiny Gold X. Last episode we left off here where we are gonna go see Professor Elm. Cause he's just freaking out for some reason. Oh yeah, he got robbed I think. Yeah, DJ. DJ is a criminal, he robbed him. So right here I wanna show off this thing. Yeah, watch this. Oh god, he's standing on me. Hey, get off me Professor Elm. Yeah, I find that funny, but you know. In, in the future beta, you might want to fix that or something. I, I don't think you can fix it, though. Like, make him bounce backwards or something. Anyway, let's heal up toe to dial with this thing. Um, You can't run inside buildings here. I dislike that. In Rejon, we, I remember we could run inside buildings. Well, we do have super speed, so that makes everything better. Uh, this guy just gave me Pokeballs. I'll use those later. By the way, I want to thank... Right off the bat, Legendary Pichu on YouTube, because he taught me Camtasia. He taught me how to see how much time I've got on Camtasia. So, thanks to you, dude. I really needed that. I, I, I really couldn't figure that out. Um, And then your mom gives you running shoes right here. I don't know if you can run inside buildings, by the way. I don't think you can. That's, like, region exclusive. No, you cannot. Um, But I do have super speed, as I said before. So, now let's... Oh, God, what do you want? No, I know how to catch Pokemon. I'm not an idiot, you know? I'm I'm actually quite smart. Alright, so, either way, let's scratch the heck out of this Pidgey. Oh, oh, come on, you got critical hit, really? Um, I'm not sure if I'll catch any Pokemon before the first gym, because the first gym is kind of early in the game, so... I don't know. Alright, I guess I'll take this time to mention... I know I've been mentioning for the past few days I'm going to Florida on Monday, so I don't know if I'll be able to record, but I'm going to start pre-recording episodes tomorrow. Yeah, I'm going to pre-record about 10 or I don't know how many episodes I can pre-record, but just enough so that you can, it can hold out during the summer. And I'll upload them, I don't know how often, but yeah, I'll just pre-record starting tomorrow, pre-record some more Saturday, and then Sunday I'll pre-record a few more. Hopefully, I'll get enough to last you guys. And then Platinum, I'm probably not going to be uploading Platinum. Yeah, I'm going to finish the Elite Four soon, and I'm not going to be able to upload Platinum. So, you guys will have to hold out with Shiny Gold X during the summer. Yeah, it's pretty much just an update on Shiny, uh, on Munching Orange, pretty much. My whole account, that's going to be what's happening and stuff. Um, if you guys haven't noticed, I'm just randomly grinding to level 12. Not sure why, but, you know, it, it feels like a time to grind before the first gym and whatnot. Um, so now let's heal up and go to the next route. Yeah, for now, I don't think I'll be picking any, any, uh, team members, because, yeah, it's been kind of hard to pick team members for me in Shiny Gold, because, you know... It's a big challenge, so I need Pokemon that are tough and defensive and offensive at the same time. And here's our first trainer battle that's not a rival. Which reminds me of Carlos. That damn Carlos. Hate him. Hate him with all my heart, stupid Carlos. If you notice, his name was Trainer1. I really don't understand that, but whatever. Alright, here's Youngster Mikey. Got a Pidgey. I'm gonna pwn his Pidgey. Alright, that was kind of easy. Another Rattata here. I'm gonna pwn him. Oh, oh, you did not just quick attack me. You did not just quick attack me. That's nice. I'm not stealing any trainer's Pokemon, but whatever. Wait, what? Oh. Oh, you, you suck. That was kind of stupid. Hey, I'm not a trainer, but, you know, if you look me in the eyes, it would seem as if I'm a trainer, but I'm really not. So, I just pretty much made a fool of you. Yeah, yeah, go ahead and make a fool of me, stupid girl. Hopefully, I can kill this Caterpie. I mean, seriously, it would be so embarrassing to get killed by a Caterpie. <coughs> ah, water gun, finally. And Totodile should be evolving quite soon. So, yeah, Totodile is evolving really early in the game, I gotta say. Let's go ahead and heal up again. By the way, I'm definitely not using Pidgey. Someone last episode was like, 
For the love of God, don't use Pidgey. Yeah, I won't use Pidgey. Oh, got even more speed here, so I probably won't super speed at all. <coughs> so I've got super speed and double super speed right here. Um, but I'll just be using this speed right for now. <coughs> Hope you guys like that. It's pretty nice. Another Caterpie. I'm just going to run away from it. Oh. And uh, Dark Cave. Yeah. Antidote. And here is Dark Cave. You can catch Zubats and other random Pokemon here, but nothing I'm going to use. Geodudes. I, I could use a Geodude, but I need to research on how it evolves into Golem. I believe it. it's not by trading, so... You know, I'll research that, and maybe I'll use a Geodude in, in this run-through. I mean, he's a good defensive Pokemon, so... What am I even doing? I'm exploring this cave for no reason. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I'm exploring this cave at random. You can furtherly... Oh, I could kill these with Water Gun. Yeah, you can furthermore explore this when you've got Flash. Makes it a lot easier to explore and stuff. Oh, gosh. Oh, uh, where am I going? Seriously, I need to get the heck out of this cave, so... Huh? What is this? Okay. So, apparently... Oh, God. Oh, God. Level 25 nose pads. Wow, if I manage to kill this, this thing, I swear, I will be the luckiest guy ever. Yeah, I, I expected not to kill him anyway, so. If I kill him, though, if I kill him, though, I swear I'm the... Oh, yes, I killed him. I'm so cool. Yeah, level 14. What? TMO4? Oh, rollout. All right. So, random guy there. I, I don't think I was supposed to fight him yet, but, you know, I'm, I'm a cool guy, so I fought him now. Yeah, you guys better explore this cave when you once you've got Flash. But, you know, I, I, I was lucky enough to have Totodile right there, so I could kill that guy. Now, let me get the heck out of this cave. I swear, this is so hard. Aha, finally out. Now, to continue with our regular programming, let me heal up. Oh, oh, I'm paralyzed. That sucks. I believe this guy gives you an HM later on, or TM or something. Yeah. Um, let me fight this bug catcher here, and yeah, I'll wrap it up for today once I get to Violet City. I think that's what it's called, Violet City. All right, here's a Caterpie. Uh, I I hate bug catchers. I swear they're so annoying. And now that I've got Rollout, that would be pretty good to give to Geodude. Actually, I could catch a Geodude and teach it Rollout. That would be pretty nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, but I really need to research on how Geodude evolves in this game, so... Depending on how it does evolve, I might or might not use Geodude. I don't know. For now, it's just me and Jaws. Wow, I, I'm, I keep thinking, and there's more and more reasons to ge use Geodude. I mean, a Geodude would help me out against the first gym. Like, if it had Rollout as a Rock-type move, that would really help me out in the first gym. And you know what, guys? This is making me think. I'm gonna... Yeah, I'll be right back really soon. I'm gonna go research how Geodude evolves. And, you know, I'm gonna catch a Geodude. So, yeah, we're in Violet City. I'll be right back. Okay, so after some investigation, I found out that Geodude evolves at level 42. Well, it evolves into Graveler normally. Like, I don't know what level it is, but... From Glaveler into Golem, it evolves at level 42. So, I am indeed going to catch a Geodude and use it in my run-through. Aha, here's the perfect one. And, yeah, it's going to be hard to catch because Rage doesn't do crap to it. But, you know, Rage progresses and gets stronger with each hit. So, that's good. And, I really don't have a nickname for him yet. Uh, let me just throw a Pokeball for now. And here is our Geodude. And I just thought of a nickname. It's very random, but... Yeah, everyone should know the reference to this. He's going to be using a lot of rollouts, so I'm going to name him Pinball. 
Now here's Geodude, uh, Pinball the Geodude. He's going to be our new member of our team. Um, see his stats really fast and wrap it up for today. Bashful Nature, not sure what that does. Yeah, he's defensive and attacking, so I guess that's good. Um, so that's it for today. Next episode, we're going to train Geodude at the Sprout Tower, I guess. And yeah, face the gym, I guess. I don't know. See you guys next time. Hold on, hold on. Uh, yeah, see you guys next time.